Greetings, and welcome to this episode in the series of videos on LiDAR with ArcGIS Pro. This series is brought to you by AmericaView, in partnership with the College of Natural Resources and Environment at Virginia Tech, the Virginia Cooperative Extension, and GeoTED UAS. I'm Cherie Auckland, and I'll be your guide. Numerous geoprocessing tools are available in any GIS for vector, raster, or LiDAR point cloud data. With ArcGIS Pro, many of these tools are context sensitive. They activate when a vector, raster, or LiDAR point cloud has been selected in the contents. The tools associated with the selected data type appear on the title bar, accompanied by one or more tabs of its own grouped within the new toolbar. For example, selecting a vector feature layer produces the feature layer tools in the title bar and the appearance, label, and data tabs. Similarly, selecting a raster layer activates the raster layer toolbar with the tabs Appearance and Data. Let's select a last data set. In this video, we'll review these tools. How to use them will be covered in a later chapter. Begin with the map scene that was created in the last chapter on Exploring Last Dataset Properties. Let's select the first layer in the Contents pane. Notice the Last Dataset Layer toolbar is enabled with its three tabs. Appearance, Data, and Classification. Open Classification. These icons represent tools for classifying the individual points in the selected point cloud layer. They'll be discussed in detail in the chapters on classifying a LiDAR point cloud. Open the Data tab. Here you see tools organized into two groups, Management and Analysis. These icons represent shortcuts to the most frequently used tools in these categories of geoprocessing. All of the tools can be found in the toolbox. Most of these operations will be covered in other chapters. Now open the Appearance tab. Visibility range, effects, and point thinning are discussed in more detail in later chapters. This ends the introduction to the last datasets toolbars. The next few chapters will utilize these tools extensively.